first, we go to Ben Winslow. He broke the story this morning on Live at 11 and has the latest developments from Capitol Hill. This is some good news. The latest order by the Utah Department of Health starts to outline lifting the mask mandate and other restrictions. There's an epidemiological endpoint, which is no new cases for 28 straight days. And then there's got to be a little bit more of a practical and Utah Department of Health Executive Director Rich Saunders confirms to Fox 13 he's working on plans to lift COVID-19 restrictions, including the mask mandate. Here's how it will work. Eight weeks after Utah gets 1.6 million doses of the COVID-19 vaccine allocated, the counties in the lowest transmission spread of the virus can lift mask requirements. Sufficient to cover about 70% of our 16 plus population then at that point, um, giving it eight weeks. That should give COVID-19 cases more time to drop and state health officials the ability to vaccinate as many people as possible. Here's where Utah is right now on its virus transmission index. Only a handful of sparsely populated counties are in the low spread category right now. We're in a, a, a relatively good spot and the mask requirement, which is a really good requirement. Uh, it's the cheapest, most the, the least invasive measure that it makes the biggest difference. It just stays in place until the vaccines do arrive. Health officials are also planning to tweak other restrictions. COVID testing will be expanded in schools. Dances can resume if all students who attend agree to get a test. Bars in the moderate and low transmission levels can increase occupancy to 75% if they can still ensure physical distancing. Movie theaters and sporting events can resume as long as masks remain and people attest to being COVID free. Meanwhile, bills that put more scrutiny on public health orders are advancing in the legislature. The Senate passed a bill giving lawmakers the ability to shut down health orders, but Senate leaders insist they may not even use it. Right now, there's not a lot of need. We're, we're winding down COVID, and I think we're seeing some of the restrictions be lifted. Now, Governor Spencer Cox told Republicans here on Capitol Hill that more counties may move to moderate, and we may be celebrating mask-free and in large groups by the 4th of July, if not sooner. On the Hill, Ben Winslow, Fox 13 News.